Hey everybody, Brian here from QuantLabs.net. I am going to walk you through a way to basically build out a library, a third-party library that will build out um, a connection into C++ the right way using Ubuntu Linux. Um, so if I go into my virtual machine, um, god damn. Ugh. Okay. Finally, let's see what we got here. Let me go back here. So what we're going to do here is if you go to this GitHub repository, uh, what you do in your terminal is you got to make sure you have the correct C++ tools. I'm assuming you know how to do all that. Um, just clone the GitHub repository in your directory wherever you want to go, where, where you want it to be. Navigate into it, do a cmake dot make, and that's it. The last thing you need to do is to make sure in your TWS you... Uh, you set the port correctly that matches with the test app. So what I'm referring to here is uh, here's that repository that I've talked about uh, for the TWS uh, API CPP. So what we want to do is if we go into Okay, that's TWS bitching. Okay, so if we go into test, I'm sorry, it's SRC for source. Uh, you'll notice we have the source code there for um, test. So in here, if you look for, uh, in our case, 7496 is the port number. You wanna make sure you, you match up the port and your configuration in TWS for that. Okay, um, otherwise you get that uh, connection error. Okay, so here's the connection, uh, line 247, 7496. So in your TWS here, if you uh, go under configure, and then API here, download, all that stuff you should know. But here is, uh, 7496. So when we go back to the terminal, uh, looking for our bin files, which are here in green, we run the test. We can now see that we're getting data from TWS with the proper configurations. Okay, so if you run some of the other tests like uh, bars, that runs as well. Uh, okay, so connectivity. So I think that TWS is having a problem of some kind. But it does work, um, as you can see. Um, but uh, let me try another one. I did confirm it was running. Thing. Oh, you know why? Oh. Maybe it's shut down the uh, TWS or the IB. You have selected live trading mode, but the specific user is a paper trading. Uh, well, whatever. Okay. Uh, let me try one more. It'll probably not work, but that's okay. Maybe I'll try. Let's try clients. No security definition. Yeah, so it's not connecting. Let me just try the. Uh, it's something to do with this paper trading versus live mode. But uh, I do know it works. But I'm just showing you the various ways to do it. Seems to be working there. Error not connected. Oh well. But you saw it connected earlier. But we'll leave it at that. And uh, just for those that are more advanced that want to see it run. Um, let's try it again here. We launched the TWS. 
this here. There we go. So we want e demo user demo user password. Oh, I see what the problem is. Training mode. We want paper trading. That's a new. So simulated. That's what the problem was. Okay. So we should be okay now. I've never seen that option before. Okay, so I'm gonna go in configure. Okay, so we're going to classic TWS mode. Okay, configure, API, settings, read only, enable ActiveX. So the port we want, it was 7496. Okay, apply, okay, let's recheck it took that port number, yeah, took it, cancel, okay, so we should be able to run now, there we go, yeah, it's connecting no problem now, okay, so let's see what other bars, so it's all running now. Uh, this I don't think does anything. Yeah, it does. Market data error. Okay. So we have uh, one more time. Clients. Yeah. Probably have to be uh, a live trading. Have a live trading account. All right. So we've got a good chunk of it working. We figured out what that issue was. Thought I just put that together and thanks to uh, James for showing this to me, but it's pretty straightforward as I've, I've typed out the um, instructions. So the other thing is the summary is that I was not able to properly build it within um, within my C++ on Mac for some reason. Um, let's see here. Same, same steps. Okay, so if I go into TWS, I'm able to do a CMake on it. Okay. So let me just make sure I'm in the right folder. We've done the C make, so let's just do a make. Yeah, there's the error. I'm sorry, it's some stupid error, but it compiles no problem on Linux, but bombs on uh, Mac for some reason. But I'm not going to worry about it. But I just thought I'd show all this in the experience so far, but I got it working in Linux, which is a big deal. All right, hopefully I'll help you out. Talk to you later.